Hello and welcome to Avoiding Big Brother. In today's video I'm going to revisit Shodan, the search engine for security researchers. The last video I did probably wasn't the best on Shodan, I'm still trying to figure things out how to use this. Um, but in this video I wanted to show you how you could uh, have a look at a network belonging to an organisation. So in this video I'm going to do exactly that and I'm going to type in an instruction in the search engine bar here and it'll be a little bit like a Google search operator where we have an instruction, a colon and then we put the target organization in there so we'll type in org colon and in quotation marks we put in the organization uh, for this example I'll use University of Derby that's the university near me so hopefully we'll have results for the UK. Indeed we do. And so down the left hand side we've got a breakdown of the ports for the results. Uh, we've got HTTP, HTTPS, uh, TCP, uh, we've got the ports related to DNS, the domain name system and port 8443 which I believe is to do with the SSL certificate and enabling HTTPS. So most of these results are probably going to relate to web pages on the server as you can see in the results we've got SSL certificates in there, we've got a logout page. So it's showing all the web pages associated with the University of Derby. We've also got products here which I think will be the web server technology involved on this network. Uh, we can see that it's using Apache there. So that's how you find results for a certain organization. You can also narrow this down by the port. So instead of getting a variety of port results, you could narrow it down to say just HTTP, HTTPS, uh, as you can see, it's showing some various information on the server as well for that web page there. So let's just try and narrow this down by the port. So for that, another instruction afterwards, if you type in port, colon, and then the port number. So let's try FTP. We may not have any results for that. So that's port 21. If not, I'll try port 80 for normal HTTP. So no results found. So let's try port 80 then. We know that there's going to be some results for that. And there we go. We've just got the results for port 80 now. So that's two things you can do the, on Showdown. We can also narrow it down by country, so you could look at organisations within a certain region, and we'll do that next. So I'm going to go back to the search bar now and type in another instruction. And this time I'm going to narrow it down by the city. So I'm going to put city, colon, then the target in quotation marks, so I'm going to put in Derby. Uh, that's my city. Now we might get results for Derby in the UK and there might be a Derby in the US as well. So indeed there is. And so we're going to narrow that down to the United Kingdom. So we click on this link here just for the UK. Now with this search it's not going to be just for one organization. You're going to have all the organizations in that region. So every organization in and around Derby and again, we've got the ports that are being used for the services, but we've also got a list of organizations as well. And it seems to be a lot of telecommunications companies there. Again, we've got the server technology, but we've also got the operating systems that are being used. So again, we've got all the results here as well. Uh, I think most of those will be HTTP website pages. So we can see the server technology, Ubuntu, Windows Server, we can have a look at a statistical representation of this as well. If you click on more here below, and then you've got a statistical 
graph here of the operating systems being used by each of the organizations. So let's go back to the results now. As you can see, a lot of it, this is going to be web pages. I can see a database there. That looks like it might be with a web hosting company, but mostly website pages. Okay, that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching.